Welcome back. And as we were last time, Magic Ender Pearl. Where is the end portal? Come on, cat horse. This way. Was it that way? I have this weird thing where um no, it's this way. I have this weird thing when I like move directions suddenly, I suddenly lose all orientation in this game. I think my mouse sensitivity is a little bit, little bit too high. Like one jerk and one blink and I'm totally lost. Too bad we seem to be leaving all of these resources behind. And that actually looks like something different. That actually looks like a stronghold. Have we made it? Is this, is this the area in which we have been seeking? Our long quest has led us to floating bars. <laughs> this looks so goofy. <laughs> it's really funny how it's done. Like it's like a, it's like a, like a jumping horse or a j horse jumping composition. I forgive me. I have no idea what they're actually called. <laughs> I'm not even sure if uh, if those even exist. But it seems like if this was a competition, then I'd be failing at it miserably. Oop, let's craft some, craft us up some torches. And I actually haven't thought about how I'm going to contain Cat Horse until I get back. Because, as it turns out, I don't have any slime balls for leads. Oh gosh, whew, that's kind of scary. That's actually pretty cool. It's like the un underground library right there. Let's actually do a lot of exploring before we go to the end portal. Because I think that is the end portal right there. Oh, whoa. Flying bombs. And Cat Horse is long gone. Cat Horse, I can't save you when you're all the way over there. Okay, let's let's retreat. Um, I'm just going to have to trust that Cat Horse is still there when I come back. Um, if he's not, then I'll just keep searching till I find him. But for right now, I'm in a little bit too too much danger to be worrying about cat horse is this trapped no it seems fine looks like we got a bunch of new items excellent and this library the underground library this place is sweet i can't wait to check what's out what's in here lots of string for more bows perhaps later and i can pick up a lot of these books with that encha my enchanting table oh what is this lighting bug yeah Whenever I see a lighting bug, I always think it's something like really cool, and then I get closer, it's just like, oh, it's just, just bugs. It's a little bit disappointing, but at least there's a chest. Was that chest here? Was that chest literally here? Like, all right, so let me let me give a rundown of what just happened. So, oh, actually, let me take care of this creeper first. So what just happened is I came here, and I was like, oh, this underground. Oh, sorry, this uh. This in the ground library is so cool. Can't wait to check it out. See what loots here. And this chest is like sitting right here, like right in front of me. Ooh, I really want this at one actually. Really valuable for the Ender Dragon fight. Let's actually start eating our new melons. I know that um, there's some foods in Minecraft that are like objectively better than the rest than eating other foods like melons i know that are like a really bad food in terms of how much saturation it fills it's only just like really easy to get but i personally i think melons are actually my favorite food in minecraft which i don't know why i have no reason for melons to be my favorite food i just like eating them it takes such a long time to eat they don't even heal that much but it's just so much fun for me oh i somehow thought that they would be connected there why did I think that? All right, are we able to do a little bit of uh, parkour here? Super dark, the parkour map. Nope. <laughs> that was the most miserable uh, moment of parkour. I'm sorry, I'm such a shame. But yeah, it seems like this is the actual end. And maybe we can wait for these guys to filter out before we rush in there to our deaths. Or not. Yeah, there we go. I'll take care of these couple of guys first. And let's destroy this. Destroy the spawner first as well. I don't really have a need for a silver fish spawner. They don't really drop anything. There's a couple more silver fish around here. I wonder where. Let's first let's first count up how we need how many we need. We need six. I got seven. Way more than enough. 
If we want to, we could go inside and uh, fight. Oh, whoa, what? What? I didn't mean to do that. I'm not prepared for this fight. <laughs> I didn't even fall in. No way. Am I stuck here now? Okay, this episode has turned from a... Uh, into a very weird episode. So how am I going to do this? So I have a book. I have an affinity book. I have no obsidian. I can't create a crafting table. Or not uh, an enchantment table to apply that affinity. I only have 13 arrows. Two iron swords. This is going to be so rough. <laughs> but we're going to try our best, I guess. Um, let's make two with what we have. We can make a diamond shovel. Uh... <laughs> Hold on, I just have to really think about this. Uh, we have a saddle for the horse that we don't have. We have an ender chest. Let's actually see what's inside our ender chest. Stone nothing, that's good. Maybe we should just drop off all of our valuable supplies because I know that I'm going to die here. It's probably the smartest thing I've thought of yet. Uh, let's just put away most of this. Because... I can't see how I'm winning this fight at this <laughs> at my perspective right now. Um, let's just make our way up, see what we can see. Maybe there's a little bit of a twist in the end too. Otherwise, nope, looks like there's at least a standard amount of Ender Dragon. Oh, is it gonna hit me? Is it gonna? I really don't want it to take out my chest. I at least want to be able to come back here and drop off my stuff before I die. Oh, whoa, whoa, that was a big hit. I couldn't even see it. It's like a ender worm, an ender tunneling worm. I'm scared, I'm scared. Oh, I'm almost dead. Is this thing gonna kill me before I even, before I even get out to the open? All right, I'm just gonna beeline for the end. All right, it's coming back, it's coming back. Okay, okay. Oh. Where am I? Whew, I'm so scared. <laughs> no, it's right here. It's right here. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Okay. I'm not dead yet. Maybe it would be not such a bad idea to actually bridge out from here. And just nerd pull it back up. I mean, I'm sure this is actually a terrible idea because it's just gonna come flying out of nowhere and hit me down. But... Maybe we can see it before it comes to us and hit it with our arrow. Okay, let's compose ourselves. We have been p placed in this predicament, so we have to make the most of it. I mean, I swear, I was just walking over the side of the portal, too. Hmm. Let's see. I don't see any Ender Dragon yet, and I seem to be recovering health painfully slowly. I, have to, I should probably save my arrows for some of the taller obelisk towers, which probably means I'm going to be whacking that ender dragon with a sharpness one iron sword. <laughs> I had so many plans left in the overworld. I, I, I shouldn't have filled in the portal entirely. That was a mistake. All right, here, here. I see it. It's coming. So I pretty much will be trying to take down this ender dragon with 14 potatoes. 14 potatoes, 4 melons, no other source of food. Yeah, maybe the hunger is going to get me before anything. Yeah, here it comes. Alright. Ouch. Yuck. It's not going to do any good. Let's just do our best to take out all of these. Hmm. Yeah, for these shorter ones, I'm definitely going to try and just bridge. Or not bridge. I keep saying bridge when I actually mean ladder. Ooh, ow, ow. That was a big hit. That hurt. I really gotta keep my eyes open, too. I really can't keep my eyes open for these... Oop. Ender men. At least I expected that. You know, I'm not, I'm not even disappointed. I'm not even disappointed. I went in there thinking that I was gonna die horribly, and it just all came true. So let's not do that again. Too bad I lost my uh, my sharpness sword. Maybe next time I go into the end, I can pick it back up again. Well, it does give us an excuse to use up our use our awesome armor. 
So what do I need to remake? We need to ma remake that pick. We re need to remake that pick. And the sword. At least we, at least we got out a pretty decent amount of items. That's a definite plus. <laughs> I'm really glad I had that ender chest on me. Hopefully the dragon didn't destroy it in the meantime. And we can put away some of those items and at least recraft. Oops, where's the wood? At least recraft our set of items. So we can place that there. Get the iron out. I'm such a haphazard, haphazard crafter. I say I'm gonna craft something, and then like five seconds later, I completely forget about it. So what do we need even? I think I can create a cobblestone axe and hoe, or not axe and hoe, but axe and shovel. Those aren't things that you really need something really advanced for. And the hoe can go back in the farming chest. And this can go back in the equipment's chest. And the rest can be put away like normal. And unfortunately, we have probably lost track of Cat Horse. <laughs> We're going to have to go pick up Cat Horse from wherever Cat Horse is. Luckily, that's probably our next destination, considering in that direction is the, the other mine shafts that I saw. Let's actually make the rest of these torches. And uh, let's head back up to pick up Cat Horse and maybe even get some more tools. Do I need anything? I don't think so. Let's head back off. And this time let's not dance around the end portal. That that was that was embarrassing. Really harsh. Oh man. Did I fall in? I may have I may have just like slipped and fallen in. <laughs> yeah, definitely the best idea would have been to not not even finish the portal until I knew I was going to go in. But we got the infinity book. Oh, what I didn't make was a bow. But we can always make a bow later. What I need right now is maybe some more diamonds so I can make some diamond armor. Stock myself out with diamond armor. Enchant my bow. And then we can go into the end and finish off this game. Once and for all. Finally conquer super dark survival. So we're actually pretty close, I guess. I mean, I only dealt a sliver of damage to the ender dragon. I wouldn't say that was much of a fight at all. But, you know, better than nothing. We found the end portal. That's a, that's a pretty big achievement. I have to go all the way down this line to find it, though. Hopefully we can maybe expand the, the width of light in this area. Create a light highway to the end portal. I'm actually looking maybe if we can get some rails. We can make a rail all the way to the end portal as well. So... In the inevitable times, I'm gonna die miserably fighting the Ender Dragon. At least I can just pop on a, pop on a rail and get back there. All right, how long is this thing? That's probably just the uh, user super speed to get there in an instant. Super speed activate, and bam! Wow, we're really fast. Um, ignore that all of these seems to be artificially placed. But we made there, made it here uh, pretty quickly, huh? All that took was <laughs> all the rest of our six melons. So we're back to eating rotten flesh. And now at least we can have Operation Save Cat Horse to begin. And Cat Horse is around here somewhere, right? But for some reason, I don't see him slash her slash ambiguous gendered horse. Where could he have gone? Hmm. It's kind of disturbing. Where did he walk off to? Horses don't do spawn, right? Hmm. Troubling. Let's see. Let's maybe check back in the library area? That's where I was before, and maybe a horse could get stuck down there. Maybe the horse went down below? Interesting. I'm not sure. Not sure where this horse could have gone. But at least... Oh, oh, ouch. Ooh, here comes the mob. Here comes the, the gang of bullies. And I am still only have their flesh to eat. Alright, let's... Uh, let's make it to the chandelier. Oops, that's not the chandelier. That was a horrible miss. <laughs> at least they're going to get down here and uh, get stuck in all these cobwebs. 
as we can see. Oh, ouch. Oh, no. There's not going to get stuck in the cobwebs. I'm going to get stuck in the cobwebs. This situation has turned into a, uh, in a struggle for life. Oh, gosh. Library bullies. Uh, at least they're all, like, kind of sticking to themselves there. Sorted. Not too bad. This guy is all stuck in the library. He's, like, really fretting that he uh, has an overdue book. Look at him spinning with worry. All right, let's get out of here. I have no interest in these people's overdue books. You know, what can I do here? I can ex keep on, oh, ouch. I can keep on exploring the stronghold or I can try find one or try to see what's in one of those mine shafts. I think there's probably gonna be interesting loot in both, but let's go around this stronghold first since I'm already here. We already found something pretty valuable. You know, a uh, <laughs> an illegitimately spawned torch. <laughs> Oh, that's a horrible sound. Hate that sound. All right, let's see what's in this chest before we end things off. All right. Are you trapped? No, you seem to be valuable. Pigs, awesome swords, and diamonds. That's pretty awesome loot to end off the episode on. Let's just take care of these uh, mobsters. And then we can start looting some more areas when we get back next time. So thanks for watching, and hopefully we can find Cat Horse next time. See you guys later.